Tom, Zach. I'm gaming with Bob and Zach, uh, or Zach and Bob, I should say. And it's, we're back with another gaming with Zach, and this is the Thursday episode. And uh, as you know, all this week we're playing uh, games that start with the letter Wii. I mean, with the word Wii, as in the Nintendo Wii. And today we're playing the sequel to Wii Play. Wii Play Motion for the Nintendo Wii. I'm going to show you all 12 of the games that are in here. Just like I did for yesterday. Alright, let's get the game started. First game is the ice cream mode. So we gotta calibrate our Wii Motion Plus like we did for Wii Sports Resort. There we go. And we're ready to go. Just a second. Alright. So in this one you have to hold the remote straight up and you have to try to balance your ice cream cone while scoops of ice cream are being poured from up in the air. Two scoops, that's not too bad at all. I think my record is 80. But still, it's not too bad. Alright, let's move on to the next game. Whack-a-mole. Well, I, I like to call it whack-a-mole, but... You guys can kind of call it whatever you want. The thing is, I don't think I can play this one because, uh, you know what, I'm going to play a different mode. Hold on. I'm going to play the different, I'm going to play the memory mode. Because I don't want to spoil too much of the game for you guys. I'll let you guys find out what the regular mode is. I think I have that on my channel, so. I just want to make sure because I have the box right here, but I want to display it, so. Um, so this is just plain memory, so here we go. Okay. So yeah, it's pretty much just like memory. Point so far. Red, blue, red, red, blue, blue. Boom, 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 boom. Red, red, blue, blue, yellow. Red, red, blue, blue, yellow. And there's a purple one that that the that the box is blocking. So, red, red, blue, blue, yellow, blue. Blue, uh, red, red, blue, 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 yellow, blue. This guy's getting bigger! 
Red, red, blue, blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Oh. Boom, 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 boom. Yellow, blue, purple. It gets pretty hard now. Red, blue, blue, yellow, blue, purple. Okay. Okay, so boom, 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 boom. Wow. He's getting huge. Ah. Red, red, blue, blue, yellow, blue, yellow, blue, blue. Okay. Red, red, blue, blue, yellow, blue, green, boom, boom. I want to make it to ten. We can do this. Sweet. Did we beat it? Oh my god, really? <laughs> red, red, blue, blue, yellow, blue, pink. Man. Oh god. Wow. Holy crap! This is insane. Red, red, blue, blue, yellow, blue. Wow! Unbelievable! Thirteen. My lucky number. Red, red, blue, blue, yellow, blue, purple, green, blue, blue, red. Oh, it's two for the... God dang it. But I got a new record. Heck yes. Alright, next up we're gonna do the skipping, the skipping mode. Throwing stones down the pond. So you want to do it kind of like you're just throwing a frisbee, I guess. I don't know. It's just a... Okay. Alright. So yeah, it just all depends on how you throw it. 24. So now, if you press control pad, it kind of just tells you how well your shot was. Okay. So 79 out of 100, so I need to lower that down a little bit. Twenty-nine, all right, much better. Eighty-eight, all right, I'm getting a little better. So you have that, they've got new ones now. Like a chicken. It's gonna hit the rock. Bull! Twenty. Ooh, the boomerang. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Ooh, 33. My record is 47 on the, on, a, on one throw. I'm throwing these hard enough. 23. Pfft. All right, so overall, I got a total of 129 points. So if you guys saw the We Play episode yesterday on yesterday's episode. Um, 
there was the Pose Me one, but they actually brought that one back. And this one's called Pose Me Plus. And I gotta tell you, I love this one. This one's much more fun than the bubble one. Because this is actually kind of like human Tetris in Japan. You gotta match the poses. Or like the US game show Hole in the Wall, if you prefer. I used to watch Hole in the Wall with uh, Tech Holmes, but I think it got kind of lame. And they started uh, airing a lot of repeats. So. Ah. I want to try to go for a perfect. So yeah, you get three hearts and you want to collect these gems. And there's five stages in all. Ah. Got them all. I never miss a crystal. I never miss one. I'm like pro at doing that. Final stage. Ah! Crap! Ah! As you can see, it's much harder. I have gotten a perfect on this before. Oh my god! One more heart left. Okay, thank goodness. Six hundred and ninety-four points, not too bad. My record is nine sixteen. So I got two thirds of my high score. Alright. <laughs> Alright. And we're gonna play trigger twist now. Uh, we'll do a ninja stage. That sounds pretty cool. This is pretty much uh, just like the first stage of the Wii Play, the shooting, the shooting range. You can actually look around your, you, and you don't even have to aim at the sensor bar. You can get combos. What? I missed him. Level 2, watch out for ninja attacks.
Level three, save the meter care. Save the meter characters. at me. That was kind of cool. Look at me. <laughs> 8,760. Silver medal. Alright, next up is Jump Park. Gem Hunt. We'll do stage one. So this one you have to jump around and just collect all these crystals. by pressing A and jumping off these bouncy platforms. I love the noises my knee makes since he's so tiny. Jump Park. Next up we got Teeter Targets. And there goes the box. God. sideways to play this. Booyah! I'll show you two more stages. stage. What the? Oh, there's a wall right there. Restart. <laughs>
All right, back to the main menu. This one is awesome. We're going ghost hunting, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, it's, uh, it's kind of hard to explain this, but I'll go ahead and kind of explain it thoroughly. Uh, so we have to search around the room by pointing my Wii Remote around the entire room, and I gotta and I have to hear for ghosts. And I have to hold B and drag him into the ghost machine. It's kind of like Luigi's Mansion in a whole different way. Got him. So you drag him to there and let go of B. Got him. Got him. Or not. Got him. Oh, it's a big guy. Get up furniture. I almost got him. Got him. Uh oh. Three ghosts left. You wanna wait till Got him. One more ghost. Got him. Oh, my guy is huge. Oh, no! God, why did I do that? There he is. Got him. There we go. 1,324, add that to that. 1,532. Got a silver medal for spooky search. So yeah, it's a really cool way of playing. All right. Uh, I don't want to spoil the solo mode for this one. So it's pretty, it's pretty sweet, but I don't want to spoil it too much. All right, I'm gonna show you guys the long jump game. I think I, I, th I think I did some solo mode for this, but I like this long jump. So basically, you're Mary Poppins in a different way. Um, basically, you're racing down with this umbrella, and you're jumping off, and you're doing a big long jump for the whole world to watch. Here we go. Ah. Ah, that was terrible. 568 meters. I can do much better than that. Good thing they give you a second chance. That was kind of a warm-up one. So I went off a little too late, so now I know when to go off. Way too early. What the heck? That was weird. Alright, try it again. Actually, you know what? Never mind. But I can do much better than that. Go watch some gameplay about my channel. I think I did pretty good on that. <laughs> Treasure twirl. Alright, so we gotta reel the treasure in. Let's go in. So we gotta go all the way down. 
And we want to collect these diamond things along the way. Actually, I'll go this time. Go left here. Pick up this. Now we move our way up. more air. And there we go. It's a pretty fast but simple one. And the treasure is ours. Got a perfect score. I think that's the first time I've ever gotten a perfect score on this one. Alright. Next up is Flutterfly. We'll do Sage 3. That's when you're actually uh, shaking your room out to blow your leaf. You're using it as a leaf, like that. Oh god. That was pretty good. Spikes. Another balloon. Ah. So sometimes crows will come up and try to attack you, so you gotta. Point your earmouth at the screen and shoot at it. Ah! Getting him ahead of time. <laughs> Challenge time. So we gotta collect all these pieces in time to make a flower. And it's pretty sweet when you get them all. What? No! No! Hmm. Oh well. Almost at the end, anyways. And there we go. It hurts your arm. Don't do all the stages at once. It'll hurt your arm forever. Seriously. Gold medal. Yay. All right. And for the finale, we're playing a game called Star Shuttle. So in this game, it's a little bit different than the others. Uh, you actually have to fly your space rocket into that. Try to put that in there. You don't want to use, and you want to go at once. You want to use down to accelerate. Kind of control the way you're going. Coming in clear. And land right there, and... There you go! So yeah, that's all I really need to show for that one. There's just different pieces every time and different ways you have to land. You just have to land nice and smooth. That's what I... little tip. And also a cool little thing here, if you hold B, 
It'll take you to this cool thing. You can just kind of mess around with it. And if you want to find the credits, you just twist it around to there. And it'll play the staff credits. And then also, if you wait for a couple minutes, or a couple seconds, I should say, a special little mini game will pop up. Check this out. Blowing bubbles! So you just move your Wii Remote around and blow bubbles. Shake it a bunch of times and do the little bubbles, and then you can draw big ones like that. Or like that. Or like that. That's pretty cool. Thanks guys for watching today's episode of Gaming with Zach. We play Motion, it's an awesome game, way better than we play. I'll see you guys tomorrow.